Guitar Showcase is a curated guitar show traveling around the world. Uh, we say curated because we really are selecting instruments that we consider to be unique world-class instruments that are contributing something to the conversation of the guitar. You will absolutely see archtop guitars. You will see solid body electric guitars. You will see modern fusion and metal guitars. Guitars that were inspired and, and built for famous artists. All of these things are part of the conversation of the guitar. And so we try and make sure those different parts of the conversation are represented in each tour. Suda guitar is often the jewel of many people's collections. And this is, of course, going to be an original one-off. This particular guitar was about reclaiming materials. He went to his favorite sushi restaurant in the San Francisco area where he lives, and he asked them to gather their used chopsticks. <laughs> he layered them up in multiple layers in an interesting design and made the top out of it. And then you'll see all this incredible traditional Japanese joinery. The Japanese have these really clever ways of holding things together without wood and screws. And often joints would sort of come together and they'd twist and then you'd put a peg through it and it would hold together for centuries. met Jerry and uh, offered to build a guitar for him. They talked about what that might be like. And so he built him this walnut guitar based on a Fender Stratocaster. And it became one of Jerry Garcia's main guitars. If you're a Grateful Dead fan, there's a catalog of guitars that Jerry was known to play. And this is one of those guitars. Fast forward 40 some odd years later, and uh, Dan is going through his stuff and realizes, oh, I have this black walnut from the guitars actually that I built for Jerry Garcia and Albert King still sitting here. Maybe that's valuable. <laughs> then he decides to make one-to-one -one spec sort of recreations of these. pretty special moment. There's a limited edition of them. There's only a certain amount available. You know, most acoustic guitars are built in the traditional way where they're braced up with a sound port in the center and it projects most of the sound sort of forward, meant for people to experience it. You know, but the reality is most people play the guitar for themselves uh, and they're getting kind of second best is a way of looking at it. And so a Skytop guitar is actually designed so that the sort of the best of the sound is coming at the musician. The sound comes right up at you and almost envelops you. This particular one is made with very rare special wood. 5,000 year old plus bog oak wood for the back and sides. And the, uh, the Sitka spruce top is dated at 3,000 plus years. It's a, it's a really, really special piece that there's only so much of that wood around. You, you won't see another one of those again. The Gyrock by Wild Customs in France, uh, a fascinating instrument uh, that allows you to change pickups while playing. got effectively two different toggle switches, one that moves and rotates the cylinder of the bridge and one that rotates the cylinder of the neck. You 
can swap out these things and put yourself into positions that frankly, I just don't think any guitar maker or manufacturer would ever try to do to sell you. But you can flip into that position and you may be surprised to find out the most unorthodox pickup configuration you can think of is actually your favorite and most inspiring pickup configuration. This is a really interesting way uh, to affect your guitar playing and your tones. That has to be experienced. there's a handful of guitar makers that all other guitar makers know and are paying attention to and Tao Guitars is one of that very small handful of absolute perfect execution. And the Phaeton Villa de Est is sort of their flagship. It's modeled and references a, uh, an Alfa Romeo car from the late 1930s. Villa de S is a famous place where car collectors go and gather. If you look at the back of the Villa de S, you'll notice there's no screws on the control cavities. They're there with rare earth magnets and one side uh, holds in. If you just press on it, it tips in. You can remove it very cleanly, very safely. And you look at the electronics on the inside and the electronics are done up. It looks like it was designed to be looked at, not to be hidden and covered, which is why they make it so accessible. So if you're a collector of fine automobiles and, and guitars and just love modern design, this is the guitar for you. Every one of these guitars was made by a person who had an inspiration and had the courage to follow through on it. And then furthermore, the courage to take that and share it with someone and, and see what happens and see those moments of inspiration and what changes. Guitars, they mean something to us. Guitars are more than a, a utility. They're an icon of our culture. And it's the idea that there's so much more out there that awaits us that we don't know yet. I love where we've been. I'm excited about where we're going. And that's what the Boutique Guitar Showcase is about. Mm -hmm.